Hi, I'm Dr. Mark Fryman, the Chief of Hepatobiliary Area and Pancreatic Surgery at St. Joseph's Medical Center. What I'd like to do today is to briefly explain the Whipple procedure. The Whipple procedure is a complex operation performed for pancreatic tumors, most commonly pancreatic adenocarcinoma. I would like to refer to this, to the diagram on the blackboard to help you understand uh, the steps in the Whipple procedure. The pancreas is this lengthwise organ seen right here. Most commonly, pancreatic tumors present in what we call the head of the pancreas near the bile channel. That is why patients present with uh, jaundice in the majority of cases. The Whipple procedure uh, involves removing this portion of the pancreas along with what we call the duodenum and a portion of the common bile duct. The procedure is, is typically performed by preserving the majority, if not all, of the stomach, which is outlined here. The bile duct is transected at this level, just below the liver, and the resection specimen includes the entire duodenum and the head of the pancreas. After the specimen is removed, the reconstruction is begun. The small intestine is brought up to the pancreas and sewn back to, and it's sewn back together um, in this manner. The bile duct is then also reattached to the small intestine as well as the stomach. Uh, these three anastomoses are, te are technically uh, challenging um, and do require the care and expertise of the surgeon. The Achilles heel of this operation and what has caused in the past the greatest morbidity and complications has been the pancreatic anastomosis, or namely resewing the pancreas back to the intestine. Um, with improved technique uh, and surgeon experience, uh, this has remained. To, this this has continued to be a less and less problem uh, over the years. Uh, the operation typically um, takes three to four hours to perform, and patients are in the hospital um, for seven to ten days, assuming no uh, no complications from the surgical procedure. Uh, if you have been told that you are in need of a Whipple procedure for a pancreatic tumor or pancreatic adenocarcinoma, please find a surgeon who performs this operation on a routine basis with good results.